Hi, I'm Craig Fugate, the administrator of the uh, Federal Emergency Management Agency. And hi, I'm Ernie Mitchell. I am FEMA's U.S. Fire Administrator. And we're here to talk to you about winter safety. You know, as we change seasons, hazards change. And during severe weather seasons, we talk about tornadoes. But in the winter, we talk about blizzards, snowstorms, ice storms, and a lot of weather hazards. Best way you can get ready now is make sure you have a family plan. And go to ready.gov and know what steps you need to take when winter weather threatens. But weather is not the only problem we see increase during the winter time, Ernie. We have fire problems that increase during the winter time. Typically at the beginning of winter when we fire up those heaters for the first time, we need to check and make sure they're free of lint and other combustibles before really using those. Uh, the other thing with heaters is you want to keep your combustibles uh, from being too close to the heater, so give them a minimum of three feet from things that are re readily combustible and that would be a distance from heaters or distance from fireplaces. And we also notice that sometimes people start using more candles in the winter time. And you want to at least give a foot of clearance from candles and not put them near curtains or other things that readily burn. And they should be constantly attended by an adult in the event they tip over. So again, as we get ready for winter weather, for fire safety, make sure you've got a working smoke detector and carbon monoxide detector, a fire extinguisher handy, and know what your escape plan is for your home. And for winter safety, make sure you know what to do when winter weather threatens and you have a plan. Go to ray.gov and get ready today. Thank you.